guys? So years ago, I made a video about synth with pedal boards, and I really haven't touched the subject of pedal boards in all this time. So I thought, you know, while browsing Amazon and finding the cheapest multi-effects pedal I could, I would honestly make a video about comparing it to a lot of the more expensive pedals I have, you know, over the years. So honestly, there's gonna be sort of a blind test, fun comparison part, but nobody take that seriously. Nobody watch this and take that as some scientific thing. It's just for fun to see what $50 versus something 10 times more expensive is gonna be like. So first off, let me talk about the pedal. It's this A Music DAP3 or DAP3. I honestly don't know anything about this pedal. And the only reason I have it was I was searching out another pedal by Way Huge on Amazon. It somehow led me down this rabbit hole to the most cheapest random brand name multi-effects guitar pedals around. So I went and searched for it, literally the cheapest one. And this is the one that I found. It was literally 50 bucks. And it honestly has a bunch of the same effects that a bunch of the other pedals have just in different order. So my pedal has delay, ocean verb, and rotary engine. And I honestly don't know what any of these sound like, so we're gonna talk about them later on. From initial hands-on impressions, it's honestly a lot heavier than I assumed it would be. It's all metal case. The knobs and switches, they all feel pretty decent. In terms of like the actual I don't know, build quality. I don't, I can't say it's bad because it's not. It also has cool things like a headphone jack. So hopefully there's some sort of like a stereo reverb or stereo delay in here. That would be really cool, I think. And then also it's, you know, got a DC input, no spot for batteries or anything. So there's no, you know, nine volt battery spot, but you do have your inputs and outputs that are like normal guitar input stuff. The other pedals had sometimes different forms of reverb, but they were longer or they were shorter. Uh, essentially, I feel like they're all exactly the same. So yeah, honestly, I don't really know anything about this pedal, but you know, after trying it, I really think you guys who were on the cheap might enjoy something like this. It's got what I would consider probably three of the most important types of effects that I would use, which are delay and reverb and rotary. I mean, I guess I'd have chorus, but at the end of the day, it's $55. So before we get carried away with the whole comparison thing, I just thought, let's get a kind of baseline sound and see how the pedal sounds on its own, you know? So no effects, and then let's just jump through, you know? Delay. It's real crunchy on the feedback. Hmm. That's shimmer mode. Let's try room. Try spring. Sounds a little different. Okay, let's try rotary engine. So this is in the chorus setting. Okay, let's try phaser. That's better, that's something I know. Okay, that phaser's not bad actually, to be honest.
Okay, now let's do the comparison. Okay guys, so uh, what have we learned here? Anything? Uh, I will say that as someone who doesn't usually go cheap, but is cheap at heart, this is not the worst thing I've ever heard. And it's definitely not something I would pick in terms of like my wannabe like holy grail setup. The delay I like, it's not bad. The phaser I also like, and, and I'm a big phaser fan fan, you know? Where does it stand in sort of like a multi-effects pedal? Well, 50 bucks, it's not some boutique, beautiful designed pedal. No, it is three effects for 50 bucks, which means it's somewhere around like $17 an effect. So it's not bad. I can't say that I'm the person that's gonna be the, you know, the deciding factor if you get it or not. But if your budget is that low, why not? I'm not gonna steer you away from it. So. Uh, I don't know what this video solved for anybody, but uh, like it if you did. If you're new here, subscribe. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter. Thanks again for watching, guys. And I'll see you in the next one.